Hey guys, welcome to Quick Fix. So today in this video, we will look at how you can find the index of a number uh, in a vector using iterator. So for that, I have already declared a vector. Uh, here you can see. So, so there is a function called a find function, uh, which I am going to use, and the return type of that find function is an iterator to the element. And if the element is present in the in the vector, it will return the iterator to that element. And if it is not present in that vector, it will return to the uh, last position. So I will start. So here you can see I am writing a find function, and uh, uh, the, here we have to pass three parameters. First is the starting position. In this example, I am passing the begin, and the second parameter is the end position, which will be e of n, and the third parameter is the element which you want to search. Like in this example, I want to search the uh, element seven and the number seven here, uh, whose index is three, like the zero, one, two, three. So here you can see I have written the find function, and so and if that element is present in the vector, if i t is not equal to v dot n, which means that element is present in the vector, we will output that index by i t minus v dot begin. And the else part will be element not found. So now I will run this code. And you can see the output of our code is uh, right. And now I will search the element which is not present in this list which is 10 so now you can see the element is element not found uh, in the vector is printed and I also want to tell you that the uh, time complexity of the find function is big O of n so, so keep in mind while using in competitive programming or in online competition that the time complexity will be O of n uh, depending on the start and the end. So that function will search for the element. So that's it for this video guys. If you like this video please like, share and comment. And if you have any query please write it down in the comment section. Thank you guys.